Hello, I have EA Electronics with me. And Hello. yes, and this okay. Is Oliver, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Yes, it is. And we're gonna be doing a Google Hangout talking about the latest subjects related to uh, technology and maybe go a little off course. I don't know. So first, let's start off with um, the touchscreen MacBook. The touchscreen Mac Air. The idea of a touchscreen MacBook Air. Well, about uh, yesterday, Apple upgraded the line of MacBook Pros, but did not upgrade the line of MacBook Airs, which is kind of odd, right? If you're going to upgrade the whole line of MacBook Pros, why don't you upgrade the MacBook Airs, right? Because, I'll tell you right now, Oliver, because you have 70 supports. Touch well, that leads to a good point, which leaves the room for a touchscreen MacBook Air. So, um, do you think uh, Apple will be releasing an, uh, a touchscreen MacBook Air anytime soon? Um, I honestly do not think they will, because Apple's competing with other companies and I don't think a touchscreen this sounds funny but I don't think it will help them. I think it'll hurt them because we already know that all Windows 8 computers have touchscreens. So then they would be too similar to the Windows 8 computers. Well well I have to stop here. I think Apple will have a touchscreens and they will help them compete with all those Windows 8 laptops uh because most Windows do have touchscreens. And your 70 is more of like it, it's an iOS y kind of environment, so it, it'd be much. You can't really have touchscreen in Mavericks, so it leaves good reason to uh, combine iOS and uh, OS X. And that's probably one of the reasons they did it. They're not going to do it for nothing, just for like some UI changes. I mean, and I think they will do it. I think. It, and if you disagree with us, tell me. Well, tell me if you agree with Oliver or with E Electronics in the comments and description below. Next so, topic. Yeah, now, now let me talk now. Here's uh -huh. why I think it will not happen. Because here's the problem. Everyone knows, well most people know, that now you can get a beast Windows 8 Galaxy S15 spec now. Probably one of the best Windows 8 uh, laptops out there. Well, pretty much. If, it, if, it, if it, you make a yeah. MacBook Pro, it will have the same specs, not as good, and then it will be touchscreen. What does that tell you? You know, somebody's touchscreen, right? And you know, most a lot of people are hacking Josh. So they were hacking Josh, that Windows 8 Galaxy S15, and use Yosemite, and it will kill Apple. Uh, I think you're getting a little too um, paranoid. Or it's more of a cons conspiracy that probably will not happen. Anyway, uh, I don't think the MacBook Pros will become touchscreen uh, anytime soon. But the MacBook Air is definitely 100%. Okay, next subject. What should we talk about now? Well, no, we are done with this. Here's the thing. <laughs> I'm reading this article, and it says, um, it says is that it about, the is about functional keyboard assemblies that could be found in future MacBook models. Interesting that patient image a, a specific model. The and by the way, by the way, we'll be leaving a link to that article in the description. Yes. Maybe. Probably not. We're, we're just going to say that to sound professional, honestly. Uh, Are we done so, with the subject? Okay. So how can we talk about Ubuntu? Okay, yeah, I am running the Ubuntu desktop. It is doable with Windows 8, but I have, I mainly use, um, Ubuntu is it's my primary operating system. I like it. Some people disagree, but um, I have to say it's virtually virus-free because it's less widely used, leaving less room for people to make viruses for it. And it's fast and it's free and it's open source. What is wrong with it? So like, it does all the same stuff that Windows does. It's free. It's open source. It's more customizable. Nothing wrong with it. It is. It is. It is one of the best OS out there. Yeah, I'm not it, big, I think I'm it not, might be the best, honestly. Here, I'm not that big of a Ubuntu user yet, but 
I'm, yet. But I'm going to start using it. Getting into it. Um, oh, wow. And um, I think that Ubuntu, you know, when they take over, and they dominate the world. Yeah. It is right? it's taking over. I knew Linux Mint is, is rising in the scale of the bubble movie, but Ubuntu will re remain dominant. Totally. And anyway, uh so Electronics yeah, Matt. Uh, I have posted my specs right on the screen so everyone can see if it's curious fun while you're talking. Um uh so Oliver, yes. Um, what's your favorite? You think? Are you talking about what's my favorite distribution? Linux, of, um, Ubuntu. Um, yeah, yeah. What's my favorite desktop environment? Um, yes. Well, that's a hard one. My three favorite are GNOME, Unity, and XCE. It depends the kind of work I'm doing. Uh, if I'm just like using it like at home, Unity is totally the best. If I'm uh, school work, serious work, XSCE. If I'm playing around, it's GNOME. However, I'm about to lose you for that one second. Okay, if I lose you, I'm still recording. Okay. About to lose you. Okay. Wait, we good? I'm almost back in. Hello? Are you there? Am I on? Okay. Anyway, um, um, as a bonus in this video, I will be teaching you guys how to um, set up Tor on Ubuntu. Uh, so what are we going to talk about while I'm doing this? Um, on how about let me talk a little bit. Um, okay. I Speak know your mind, about, um, uh, electronics. Uh, no, mostly, mostly, we know I'm really interested in the phones. And here's what I say. To um, Android users, right now, I think that the LG G3 is a beast phone. It's a quad HD display, which is better than the, not the better display, than the 27-inch iMac, which is amazing. Well, obviously, That's better. so does the iPhone. No. The iPhone totally has a better display than that. The iMac is, is 1920 by 1080. Are you, are you confusing with something? Anyway, no, I've had an idea. Do you know how Ubuntu has these scroller thingies? Uh -huh. uh, and you know how Mac OS, at least from Snow Leopard, um, and Mac had those blue kind of crystal things? Imagine if Ubuntu had those, but they were like crystal clear. That'd be awesome. Just saying. Just thought of that, you know. So, anyways, about the phones. Okay. Anyway, what's um, your favorite? What if you could have any phone right now? What would it be? Any phone? Mhm. Mm um, definitely the Oppo Find Seven. Oppo Find Seven. And why is that? Yeah, electronics man. Why is that? Because it is such an awesome, special phone, unique phone. Well, the most are these days. Itself is amazing. It, it just has that nice shape that that fits in your hand. And um, you want to tell all these YouTube viewers what kind of phone you currently use? Um, I currently use the iPhone 5S. Never get that phone. Um, I okay. do like Apple now. Okay, um, oh, 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 shots fired. So here's, here's the specifications. Um, it, the weight is 173 grams. The color OS is based on Android 4.3. It's a 2.5 gigahertz quad core. Com, sorry. Snapdragon 801 quad core. It has 3 gigs of RAM. And it has 32 gigs expanded onto 128 gig micro SD card. It has the distance sensor, the light sensor, the G sensor, and the 4D gy gyroscope. 30, 3,000 million AM, um, sorry, um, the, the charger, it, it has a 5.5 inch display, quad HD, 2, 2 by 60 by, uh, 1440, 538 
on pixels. Um, do you know what this? What is a better display, the LG G3 or the Apple Find Seven? Wait, what is it? What is a better display, the LG G3 or the Apple Find 7? I don't know. Let me see. Oh, dude, uh, LG G7. Totally. Uh, not necessarily. It actually doesn't say, um... Uh, it's the same... What is it? It actually has the same resolution. Um, they're both at the same resolution. They do? I think, yeah. Did you hear about that 4K laptop coming out? No, I didn't. Oh, yeah, yeah, I did. The Toshiba? Uh huh. Yeah. That would be a beast. I would love to have a computer. Who wouldn't? Uh, I forgot my. Uh, Oliver, what are you showing them right now? I'm showing you how to configure Tor and Ubuntu, but I forgot my username, or whatever it's called. So I do um, this thing. Home. Dot. Oh, do you want to know what? This is crazy. The both the LG G3 and the Oppo Find 7 oh. have the same exact pixels. Same exact display. Mm -hmm. Did you hear about the Amazon Fire? Oh, and anyway, the 4K laptop. It is the Toshiba Satellite P50T. You know how I feel about satellite computers, Oliver. Here we go, CD, home. So, anyways, the LG G3 and the Apple Find 7 have the same display. Um, same resolution? Yes, same. Yeah. Well, I'm having troubles here. What is it talking um, about? Someone, someone please, um, the... Um, something in the description um, about what phone you have now and what's your favorite you phone and what and what phone would you what's your dream phone me no no I'm talking like leave that in the description I want a bunch of comments from these people okay, see. I can't even get the Apple by itself we have to buy it on uh, Amazon it's not even worth it Oh, did you hear about the Amazon? Oh, yeah, it's the Toshiba Satellite P50T. It's coming out soon. Anyway, okay. uh, do you hear about the Amazon Fire Phone? Uh, yes, I did. And it's a, it's a very, it's very sad that Amazon couldn't come out with anything better. Well, I, I believe it's, it's I believe Amazon's it's first phone. I would give them a break. They got some cool features. It's kind of a crappy phone, but. Amazon's phone, first phone, phone, give them a break. It is a crap phone. It is a crap phone. Cool features, get first phone, give them a break. Uh, I'll actually, give it to them. What applications can you let see? They have, they have the like, balls to release that. But they really do. And this whole phone market, they they, they think they're going to spend the money. and they, they think, It's not going to get popular. Because, it's a huge mistake. I don't know what they're thinking, but... There's all these features, but applications can do it. Um, I don't know why you would get an Amazon Fire Phone. I mean, maybe if you're in love with a Kindle? Oh wait, try this. Maybe if you are, but it's not really... It's not gonna, it's not gonna go... It's just not gonna sell. It's obvious. Anyway... What else um, to talk about? Who's excited? Have, what What's the best PC? What do you mean? Like right now, I'm looking. I, I need um everyone that's watching this video to help me. So I am I I'm deciding between a couple computers. I'm first deciding between the the Mac, the MacBook, um the Mac. Fifteen inch spec out. I, Dell Express 15 spec out, and then wait, wait, no, 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 no. The Dell, the Dell XPS 15 spec out, or, or the MacBook Pro, the MacBook Pro 15 inch spec out. Well, actually, 
actually actively down would be uh two point eight gigahertz, quad core, cell core seven, promo boost up to four 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 gigahertz, wow. Uh five hundred and twelve gigabyte PCLE. Wait, PCLE is not SSD, is that correct? Um what now? PCLE is not <laughs> SSD. Okay, anyway, for the people, um, I haven't set this thing up in a while, but, let's see, just keep going talking. Yeah, electronics wait, back. Wait, wait, Oliver, is the PCLE a SSD or not? What? What is exactly, what is exactly a flash storage? Flash storage? It's a fancy name for an SSD. Oh, really? Nothing to do with the flash drive, by the way. Wait, well then, what's PCLE? Oh, that means it's smaller, is that correct? Uh, some like PCLE, just the type of SSD storage, kind of. So I could get the MacBook Pro backed out with right now, or I could even get, I was looking at this, the, the 27 inch IMAX um, spec out. It's a little expensive. No, I'll tell you, I'll tell you much of this, whatever. Yeah, it's, a bit, it's very expensive. Um, it's actually. operating system and why in the comments and, and the and most and your favorite phone and if you had all the money in the world and you could only buy parts online and you would make the most beast computer ever I'll put all the specs in the comments too and the most beastliest computer will be mentioned in the next video true story true I mean, it's not a story true statement okay. um, thanks for listening is this it? Oliver 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 out. And officially we end this video.